Hey guys, it's Greg Jones for Engine Builder. We are here at the 2022 PRI show in the Manton booth. I'm joined by Nick Bacalis of Bullet Racing Engines and behind us is his blown 526 cubic inch Hemi engine and it's our engine of the week. Engine Builders Engine of the Week is sponsored by Pen Grade One, L Ring DOS Original, and NPW. Nick, thanks so much for being here, giving us a little bit of time to you, talk about this beautiful blown Hemi here. Uh, we'd love to know a little bit more information about it. Uh, obviously, we got a valve cover off here, so we've got some stuff opened up in the valve train that we can check out. Uh, but just gorgeous engine all around. So if you would, walk us through this build a bit. Man, luckily, bless, put the motor in their booth. They just developed rock arms for this platform and their push rods, of course. Yeah. Uh, it's a CN, a billet aluminum block, but it's a Chevy 4.9 uh, Hemi deal and that was developed by Janus and by PJS Racing. Okay. Uh, it's a raised cam Chevy block, but then they do it all with the standard Hemi uh, bell housing pattern and the motor plate pattern so it bolts right in where a normal Brad deal or a Noonan deal or one of those motors will bolt right in. Yeah, so <coughs> is it like a 50-50 Chevy Hemi combo or is it one, more one than the other? Or? It's kind of its own one-off type deal but yeah. it's uh, a Chevy type deal. It's got a one-inch raise cam yeah. and then uh, running Bryant cranks on it. And then running R and R rods with custom Ross pistons and total seal rings with uh, calico coated cleavite bearings in it. Yeah. And then up in the valve train has a keyway lifter from Jezel running a custom bullet camshaft ground cam on it. Okay. And then run the Manton rockers and the Manton push rods. And then it's got a PJS manifold on it for a screw blower. And then run one of the PSI screw blowers, one of the bore hats on top of it. Uh, for mostly for pro mod, um, but then also truck pole guys can easily put it in one of the truck poles. Yeah. So uh, and then run a daily dry sump pan and pump, uh, run one of the YO Motorsports uh, balancer pulleys on it, and then uh, it runs a belt drive on it, and then lots of parts also from DMPE, yeah. and uh, it's a really good piece. Yeah, and it's gorgeous. I mean, fill it everywhere. You want to talk a little bit about some of the machine work that you had to do? On uh, the machine work, when we get it into the house, uh, we get the blocks raw to where we got to deck the blocks and bore them and hone them to our sizes and what our profilometer wants to show on it. Yeah. Then do the heads and then put on the uh, fire hoops into them and then yeah. receiver groove the block and then make sure to get the manifold fitted up and uh, port match the manifolds to the heads and just yeah. make sure it's right for making 3,500 plus horsepower to run yeah. 360s or 350s in the eighth. Crazy, crazy. Yes, sir. Uh, now, what kind of fuel would this typically run in or does that depend on the application a little bit? Uh, run methanol on them. Okay. And then we have packages if they want to do a twin turbo deal or they want to do a pro charger type deal. Right. Uh, working with Marcella on doing a manifold for the pro charger and uh, turbo setup when, yeah. uh, when a customer decides wants to go with one of those. And then, uh, always updating and upgrading trying to make things last longer and go faster right absolutely now nick you were showing me behind the hat here you guys kind of have a cool uh, setup yeah in there. board does where they do a spiral with on their hat with all the different stuff in it so that it has nozzles to cool it but then it's spun so as the air is coming through it helps with getting atomizing the air and cooling right. down the blower right. so board makes some of the nicest stuff out there yeah no really really cool stuff Nick, you gave us a nice rundown here. Anything that we're leaving out that uh, you want to mention? Uh, appreciate Larry Jeffers, and, uh, who, run, who owns Bullet Racing Engines, letting us work there and yeah. trying to get stuff going for all of our customers. And we have a wide variety of customers with the Pro Mod deal, and yeah. they build some of the top cars, so we're trying to build some of the top motors with them. So Absolutely. Well, you said 3,500 horsepower? About 3,500 yeah. horsepower. Yeah, well, again, gorgeous setup, awesome engine, and Nick, we really appreciate you giving us some time here. And no problem. Thank you, guys. Guys, make sure you're checking out Bullet Racing Engines. Make sure you're checking out Manton. Make sure you check out Engine Builder Mag for more engine content as well. 
We appreciate you guys watching and we'll see you next time. Thank you.